Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're gonna be testing out the famous Ciate liquid lipsticks. There was so much hype over social media when these came out, which is quite a while ago now, but I thought I'd test them out anyway. So these lipsticks retail for 17 pounds each and I have five of them here. So I've got some of the glitter flip ones and a couple of the holographic ones as well. I did pick these up in TK Maxx for six pounds. So I got quite a good deal on them, so I thought I'll just try a few of them and get an idea of what they wear like, how they feel, the texture, the colour. Does the glitter actually work? So we're going to be testing these today and I will basically just be popping these on my lips and showing you guys what all the colours look like. So if you're interested in that, then please keep on watching. Okay, so the first shade I have to show you guys is this really vibrant, kind of like hot glittery pink. This is the shade Love Sick. This is what the shade loves it looks like and it's very very bright pink honestly this is not something i would wear outside because i feel like this is just like too like a little bit too barbie for me but the color is really nice it's really pigmented it applied very smoothly this is meant to be one of their holographic ones so i think you're meant to wait until they like dry and sort of press your lips together to see like the holographicness i guess Oh, that's actually really nice so it definitely has brought out a lot more of the glitter would I say it's holographic probably not I mean you can kind of see like purple and kind of like a whitish silver reflex in there but it's not so much that is really noticeable if I'm being completely honest so the fact that it says holographic I honestly wouldn't even let that kind of help make up your mind on what to get because it's just not really but yeah i mean the glitter definitely comes out when you press your lips together that's really really pretty the color payoff is absolutely gorgeous um it's very very pigmented the only complaint i would have is actually the doe applicator because i found that when i put it on it's very very flimsy it's not like for example if you get an anastasia liquid lipstick or a jeffree star one the doe applicator is very very sturdy on those but this one seems a little bit flimsy, like when you press it against your lips and try to especially get in the corners, it just kind of wobbles and I don't really like that because I like it to be very precise. I think if you're paying £17 for a lipstick, like, you shouldn't really have to have that as a worry. But other than that, I think this is really, really nice. Next, I'm going to be going in with this shade here called Whisper. What does this actually look like? It looks a lot more like, a okay. Okay, so this looks like a lot more of like a brown sort of purpley nude. Yeah, this is a lot more kind of like neutral. Wow, I'm applying this so bad. Okay, so that is a rough swatch of what the shade looks like. So I'm just going to wait for it to dry and then press my lips together and see if we can activate the glitter. So this one definitely isn't as glittery as Lovestick. However, I do really, really like this colour. This is a colour that I would wear for like every single day. Um, I just, I love nudes and I love like browns and purples. Pinks I do like, but not quite as vibrant as the other one. This one is really nice. You can see a lot of the glitter coming through here. It's not as glittery as the other one, like I said. Um, the glitter particles in this though, it's actually quite strange because it's kind of a hybrid between like a gold and kind of like a forest green type of glitter in it. But I think that looks really, really nice. Um, yeah, this is one that I definitely think I'm gonna wear a lot. Also, these dry down really, really quickly. Like, I'm struggling to get this off. I'm not gonna lie. So my face is gonna be very, well, it's not gonna be neat around my mouth. And then the next shade that I have to try out is another pink one, and this is the shade Candy. This is much more of a muted lilac kind of color. Oh, I really like this. That is a Shannon colour. If you're wondering what a Shannon colour is, it's basically anything that's pink. But not bright pink. I don't like bright pink. Okay, so this is what the shade Candy looks like on me. What do you guys think? Put in the comments below because I am living for this. I think this looks so cute. I don't think it quite matches my whole like brown eyeshadow look today. But I think this is really, really nice. It's definitely a lot more kind of like of a subtle lilac pink. Lilac pink, does that make sense? Is lilac purple or pink or is it a mixture? What is lilac? Let me know. And already it's dried down so, so quickly. So if I do yeah, we can see, yeah, there we go. We can see the glitter. So this one is definitely just like a purple glitter in it. This is stunning. They feel really comfortable to wear. Like they don't feel too drying, but they don't feel too matte at the same time. So 
yeah, I'm really impressed with this so far. The next shade that I have to show you guys is a really, really bright red. So this is in the shade Scandal, and this almost looks kind of like a blood orange red. Oh, actually no, now that I've opened it, it kind of looks like a hot pink and a red. That is a really, really pigmented. Oh my God. Already I can kind of see like the glitter in it. That hasn't even dried. Okay, so ignore the fact that that is not the best application, but this looks really, really nice. This is the perfect deep red for a Christmas celebration. That's the one I'm gonna say. It's just the undertone, everything, like, it feels so comfortable to wear as well. Like it just doesn't dry out your lips. Obviously, I can't kind of testify that for the rest of the day because I'm filming this at 11 o'clock at night. But this feels really, really nice. So I'm just gonna see if I can get the glitter. Okay, so I don't feel like this one has a huge amount of glitter in it. However, you definitely can notice it when it shows up, especially in the center of your lips right there. And as weird as it sounds, I kind of expected this to be like a gold glitter in it, but it seems very like multicolored. I could see like blue, pink purple gold silver it's almost like a multi-colored glitter in there i think this is absolutely gorgeous and again i think this is just a perfect color for christmas and this one is finally the last one and it is the shade infamous or infamous i don't know how you say that this is probably my favorite so far it's a really nice kind of plum brown color the glitter effects in this one are a mixture of white and pink which i think is really really nice this is definitely my favorite like I just love this colour, it went on really nice, the pigmentation is great, so this is probably the best one for me. So overall, could I recommend the Ciate lipsticks? Absolutely. The pigment is great, they apply really well, they do not dry your lips out. Um, the claims are true, the glitter does show up, it feels really comfortable to wear. The only problem I would say for me is that the wand films a little bit flimsy for me and just not quite up with their price point. But like if that doesn't bother you, then I would highly suggest like trying these out for yourself because they're really, really good quality. That's pretty much it for this video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you did like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell and set it to all because I know YouTube hasn't been given like people notifications when I upload recently. Please make sure you do that and make sure you follow me on Twitter. Let me know in the comment section down below which lipstick was your favourite, which one you think suited me more. I think this one suits me the most, but let me know what you guys think as well. But yeah, that's it for this video, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.